Hello. Hi, hi. Hello, Hello. good evening. Good evening, Don Julio. How are you? Fine. Good, Thank excellent. You. I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Thank you. Elsa, how are you? Doing good? Hi, teacher. Hi, nice to see you. Good to see you. Ana Gabriela, hello. Jacqueline also, hello. And Tatiana, Marilyn, and Emily, how are you? Good. Good, good. good evening. <laughs> so, welcome. So, it's nice to see you again. Please, the ones who no cameras, help me out. Uh, Marvin Rudy, I just see something white, but I don't see you guys. Uh, did you receive, hello, Sylvia. Did you receive the material that I sent you? Did you receive the material that I sent you? Are you able to listen? Yes, I listen. Very uh, well. Okay, thanks. Thank you for responding. Well, we uh, have another session. So uh, again, I'll, I would like to make the invitation for you to uh, work on the platform, do the tasks over there and if it is possible for you, uh, go ahead. You can advance. Uh, don't wait for me. So, but this is the third class of this week. So we're just missing the class from tomorrow, and uh, we'll uh, see what is there. Uh, what I send you over there on the material, the thing that we already study. I had uh, some extra exercises for you to practice, and uh, to practice. Uh, uh, your English over there, along with the videos, uh, giving directions, using the forms that are weird, uh, working on it. So I hope that they will be very useful. Okay, meanwhile, let me just uh, uh, present the, it's, uh, 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 this is yours. You can miss it. Okay, uh, the first activity is, uh, it's on the, it's in breakout rooms, but meanwhile we wait for the others. So we'll go in advance for, um, in, in, in advance with another activity, okay? <clears throat> okay, so this is our uh, seventh session. This is our seventh class from this module. And uh, as, as well, so it's unit 13, you can miss it. And what day is today, guys? What day is today? Uh, today is, it is Wednesday, November 18th. Uh -huh. 20, uh, 2023. Uh, 2023, 2023, yes. Okay, so this is our, uh, uh, so again, so please work on the uncompleted platform, uh, section three, and this section on Thursday, um, my, after the class, you would like to do it the midterm, okay, please, in order to have the grace for the people who send it over there. Okay, this is a pair work, but uh, how many people do we have? Uh, uh, well, not in peers. Actually, this is, uh, this uh, I will send you in groups, but uh, meanwhile, the rest of the people come, so um, uh, we'll do another activity. We'll do the listening activity, okay? Because we already, it's 7.03, so we cannot wait, but then we go back and send you on breakout rooms. And uh, what is the listening? What is the listening activity? Uh-huh. What is the listening? Where listen is it? Where is it? 
uh, uh, remember that we are uh, asking about places in the city, okay? Like, like what places in, around the city? What places do you see on the map? What places do you see on the map? Dr. Hospital. The hospital, we, uh, the a hospital. What else, Sylvia? Uh -huh. City Bank. The City Bank. Department Store. And the Department Store. Uh huh. And what else, guys? Sylvia already said a few things. What What other places do you have over there on the map? Uh huh. Help me. My, I see a restaurant. Uh, I see a restaurant. Restaurant. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, thank movie, you. movie theater. A movie theater. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Jacqueline, help me with the learning objective, please. Jacqueline, help me with the learning objective. Uh, develop. Learning uh, develop. Develop. Uh -huh. Skills. And listen listening. for listening for details. For details. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. Skills is the same as abilities. For example, we're here we can say develop abilities and listening for details. Skills are the same thing, abilities, okay? So we, you can say, uh, well, I'm developing my listening skills or I am uh, I'm developing my uh, listening abilities. Okay, so on the map, you have different places. Let's see where, listen to the four conversations and in your piece of paper, write number one, number two, number three, and number four, okay? Because we have, and then you just write the place, okay? For, for example, let's listen over here. Page 89, exercise six, listening. Where is it? Look at the map in exercise five. Listen to four conversations. Where are the people going? Okay. One. Okay, this is the map that uh, you have on your manual, but it's the same. The only thing is that in, next, in this one, you can see the places much better, so, okay? Follow the place, uh, follow the conversation, and then follow the map over there. Hmm. Oops. I think it's on Main Street. Is it near the Regency Movie Theater? Yes, it is. It's right across from the movie theater. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's a restaurant there. Right. It's between Maria's restaurant and Luff's department store. Oh, Two. Okay, where is the woman going? It's over there. Where is the, go and the woman going? Uh-huh. Where is she oh, going? The movie theater. Uh, you had the answer over there, and number one. Yeah, the places between the uh is between the department store and the and Maria's restaurant. So where is she going? You had the answer over there. Can you see the answer? Oh, the bank. Uh, she's going to the bank. She's going to the bank. Okay, so write one, uh, two, three, four, and only write the places. Okay, uh, two. Is it near Maria's restaurant? Yes, it is. It's on 2nd Avenue, next to the supermarket. P&J supermarket? Yes, it's on 2nd Avenue between Main and Center. Okay, thank you very much. Three. Where is it? Well, it's near the movie theater. So it's on Park Street? No, it's on Main Street, next to the bank. Is it on the corner of Main and 2nd? Yes, it is. It's across from the supermarket. Thanks. Four. Is it near the bookstore? No, it isn't. It's on 2nd Avenue, across from the movie theater. 
On the corner of Main and 2nd Avenue? Yes, that's right. It's next to Al's coffee shop. Okay, thanks. Okay, let's uh, listen again, and I will make the pause, and you write the place where the person is going. Page 89, exercise 6, listening. Where is it? Look at the map in exercise 5. Listen to four conversations. Where are the people going? 1. Hmm. I think it's on Main Street. Is it near the Regency Movie Theater? Yes, it is. It's right across from the movie theater. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's a restaurant there. Right. It's between Maria's Restaurant and Luff's Department Store. Okay, the woman is going to the bank. Now let's get number two. Two. Is it near Maria's restaurant? Yes, it is. It's on 2nd Avenue, next to the supermarket. P&J supermarket? Yes, it's on 2nd Avenue, between Main and Center. Okay, thank you very much. Where is the woman going? Where is she going? She is going to drugstore. Okay, she's going to the drugstore. Yeah. Number three. Three. Where is it? Well, it's near the movie theater. So it's on Park Street? No, it's on Main Street, next to the bank. Is it on the corner of Main and 2nd? Yes, it is. It's across from the supermarket. Thanks. Uh-huh. Where is the man going? She is going to move it that Where? Move. She is going to theater. Ah, to the oh. theater. Okay, so is there another possibility? Maybe it is. Is there another possibility? Someone else has another possibility? She is yes, going to Playboy Shoot. Ah, let's see what it is. She's going to, uh, to? She's going to? Maria's restaurant. Uh, she's going to Maria's restaurant. It's across from the supermarket. It's on 2nd Avenue, okay? So number four. Four. Is it near the bookstore? No, it isn't. It's on 2nd Avenue, across from the movie theater. On the corner of Main and 2nd Avenue? Yes, that's right. It's next to Al's coffee shop. Okay, thanks. And what is, where is the woman go going? Any ideas? Where is she going? Okay, let me play the audio again, okay? Page 89, exercise 6, listening. Where is it? Look at the map in exercise 5. Listen to four conversations. Where are the people going? One. Hmm. I think it's on Main Street. Is it near the Regency Movie Theater? Yes, it is. It's right across from the movie theater. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's a restaurant there. Right. It's between Maria's restaurant and Luff's department store. Okay, your number one, she's going to... To the bank. The bank. Okay. Two. We already had the answers over is there. Is it near Maria's restaurant? Yes, it is. It's on 2nd Avenue, next to the supermarket. P&J supermarket? Yes. It's on 2nd Avenue between Main and Center. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Three. She's going to... The drugstore. The drugstore. She's going to the drugstore. Where is it? Well, it's near the movie theater. So it's on Park Street? 
No, it's on Main Street, next to the bank. Is it on the corner of Main and 2nd? Yes, it is. It's across from the supermarket. Thanks. Okay, she's going Four. to... Maria's Restaurant. Maria's Restaurant. Now, let's uh, listen for number four. We haven't had the answer over there. Is it near the bookstore? No, it isn't. It's on 2nd Avenue, across from the movie theater. On the corner of Main and 2nd Avenue? Yes, that's right. It's next to Al's coffee shop. Okay, thanks. Uh-huh. Where is the woman going? She's, She's going, going to the favorite shoes. Ah, uh, okay, favorite shoe, the shoe store. Okay, she's going to the shoe store. Okay, so this was a listening activity. Now, let me go back to the previous uh, uh, present uh, slide. And this will be on the breakup rooms, okay? Let me see, sorry, teacher. Okay, uh, no problem, thank you. And thank you for letting me know. And uh, okay, I will send you to uh, in group of four, and uh, it says fair work, but um, really, really, I uh, we're going to make it in, in groups for everybody to talk, and you're going to see the map. What places do you see on um, on Smith Street? What places do you see over there? Uh huh. What places on on Pointed? Bakery. The bakery next to the bakery is the bank. Uh, the next, uh -huh, the grocery store. Then we have the movie theater. On the other picture, what do we have? The hospital. The hospital. Laundromat. The laundromat and the park. And the park. Okay. And then on the picture below, we have the. Parking lot. The parking lot. Uh huh. And then we had the. And then we had the. Library. Uh huh. We have the library. And uh, on Smith on Smith Street and Main Street. Well, big and Pine Street. We had the. Gas the gas station. station. The shopping mall. The shopping mall. Right. Okay, we have uh, Smith Street, Main Street, Pine Street. Okay. So I ah, we miss one over here. We have uh, uh near to the hospital, we had the we had the what is next to the the, the Ah, the, the, the laundromat, yes. Okay, the question, you will be asking question. For example, what is the bank? What is the answer? Where is the bank? The bank is between the Baker, between the um, Baker the and, and the drugstore and the grocery store, yes. Oh, also here we have the bus stop. Okay, so the answer that I give a complete answer to uh, to the questions, it's on May Street um, between the bakery and the grocery store. For example, another one. Um, where is the where is the library? Where is the library? It is on Main Street. It's uh, on, uh -huh. It's on Smith Street. Ah, and next okay. to parking lot. Okay, next to the parking lot. Oh, you and, and you can say it is on the corner of uh, Smith Street on the Main Street next to the parking lot. So you can, but uh, that was a good uh, sentence okay so please uh tomar captura de, de la and then i said so you can ask the bakery the shopping mall the theater the laundromat the park the bus stop the library okay so and uh repeat with no microphone okay repeat the words okay so 
the bakery, the shopping mall, the theater, the laundromat, the park, the bus stop, the library, the gas station, the hospital, the grocery store, the parking lot, the bank, okay? So please hacer captura o la imagen and uh, for you to have it para que la tengan disponible, okay? Let me send, uh, let me, ¿le tomaron captura la imagen o algo? Yes. Okay, please. Okay, for you to have it because I cannot be in every room. So I will send you in group of, uh, how many are we? Uh, 18, 17. Okay, so 18. And I will send you in group of, of, of three. So how many breakout rooms? Uh, uh, three, six, nine, 12, uh, 16, 18, six. Let me make uh, the breakout rooms. It will be only about seven minutes. You're going to go in group of three years. Okay, you should be receiving the invitation. Please accept the invitation. Good. Senia, do you as Okie dokie. Uh, do you have the picture, guys? Do you have the image? 
Do you have the image for you to practice? Teacher, fíjese que estoy teniendo problemas de conexión y hasta ahorita me acaba de volver a entrar la llamada. Ah, ok, ok. Yeah, I saw you. Eh. No comprendo el ejercicio. Si gusta, me puede explicar. Ok, ok. Uh, right now I'm going to show you the, the, the image. Ok, and uh, you can practice. You just can ask your classmates, for example, where is the bakery? And then you will say, the ba here is the bakery. And then you will say, the bakery is on the corner of May Street next to the bank, for example. Uh, where is the shopping mall? Where is the shopping mall? Here. What will be the answer? In this case, it would be next to the gas station. Exactly. So you would say the shopping mall is next to the gas station. And you can say on Main Street or on Pine Street. Yes. Ex exactly. OK, guys, so let's practice the conversation, please. Thanks, Lee. OK, you're welcome. Hola. Hola, Nubia. We can listen to you. Let's ask each other the questions. Crisia. Where is the, the bakery? Hey, Crisia or Emily answer. Aha. Uh -huh. Answer guys. The bakery is um, next to the bank. Yeah, the bakery is next to the bank. Okay. Uh, Emily, ask another question. Where is the hospital? Guys, respond. Tatiana, Crisia, or Nubia, respond. The, the hospital is, um, is in the main street. Uh -huh. Next to park. Okay, next to the park. Or you can say across from. Okay, good, excellent. And uh, uh, ask another question. Tatiana and, and Crisia, ask questions. What is labor library? The library, okay, what is the library? Uh, good, Crisia. Someone else ask us? Someone else respond? Here is the light. Mm -hmm. Library is in front, front of bank. Okay, uh, in front of the bank or across front. Good, excellent. Okay. And ask another question. Uh, what is what is the uh -huh. the bus stop? Okay, where is the bus stop? Says uh, Tatiana. Here is the bus stop. Where is the bus stop? It's on May Street. It's on May Street. Okay, good. And you can say it's on Main Street across from the library. Good. Another question and respond. Where is um, gas station? Uh, the gas station says respond. In front of the hospital. Okay, in front of the hospital. Okay, good. Okay, so the time is up. So let me go back to close the this once. And we're about to go over there in a couple of seconds.
No se le escucha, people, teacher. Yeah, people is coming back right now. The close. I'm going to present the map again, and I will ask some questions. And please, I need some volunteers to answer quickly, okay? As fast as you can. Okay, so where is the laundromat? Volunteer. Where is the laundromat? The laundromat is on Smith Street. Okay. The, the hospital. Across from the hospital. Excellent. And where is the theater? Another volunteer. Another volunteer. Where is the theater? Here is a theater. Uh huh. The, the theater is uh, on the Smith Street. On the Smith Street. Uh, in the corner, in front of laundromat. Okay, in front of the law or across from the laundromat or in front of. Good. And where is the library? Another volunteer. Another volunteer. It's on Smith Street. It's on across the from the gas station. Okay. And or Across from grocery store. Okay, good. Or you, or you can say on the corner up too. You have different possibilities over there. Okay, so don't worry, we'll continue practicing, but I need you to practice, guys. I need you to perder el miedo de hablar. Don't worry si cometen errores, así se aprende. Okay. Mi buen amigo uh, Mauricio Ortega says that uh, si no hay errores, no hay aprendizaje. Si hay errores, sí. Okay, so please don't be afraid, okay? Okay, so we already finished with the uh, given directions. I hope the material that I send you and, uh, and the material that I send you, uh, it will be helpful for you to continue practice, okay? Practicing giving directions. Okay, so what is the, uh, this uh, imagen es un poquito diferente del que tienen el manual, but it's, we're talking about uh, tourists attractions okay what is the tourist attractions that we see on the picture what is the tourist attraction the empire state building and the spider state building thank you julio someone else someone Time else uh -huh. Time i'm sorry Time grand central uh, Times square mm -hmm. grand central terminal okay what else Rockefeller Center. Ah, okay. Uh, the, 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 the Rockefeller Center, very famous, very popular. And uh, in what city is this one? In what city? In New York City. In New York City. In what country? In the United States. In the United States. In the United States, very famous, very famous. So we are talking about this. Uh, these are the most famous places in New York City, and they are very famous around the world. Uh, uh, Robert Adalberto, help me with the learning objective. Learn about popular tourist attraction. I learn about popular tourist attractions. Okay, let's listen and read. Listen and read. Page 89, Exercise 7, Snapshot. Top Tourist Attractions, New York City. Listen and practice. Listen and read. The Empire State Building, Grand Central Terminal, Central Park, Times Square, Rockefeller Center, The Statue of Liberty, Okay, now repeat with no microphone. I try them uh, behind the microphone, okay? Page 89, exercise seven, snapshot. Top tourist attractions, New York City. Listen and practice. The Empire State Building.
Grand Central Terminal. Central Park. Times Square. Rockefeller Center. The Statue. Rockefeller Center. Statue of Liberty. The Statue of Liberty. Of Liberty. Now, let's listen and repeat. Open microphones. Microfonos abiertos. Okay, ready? Ready. Okay, yeah. okay. Page 89, exercise ready. 7. Snapshot. <laughs> Top tourist attractions. New York City. Listen and practice. The Empire State Building. The Empire yeah. State yeah. Building. <laughs> Grand Central Terminal. Grand Central Terminal. Grand Central Terminal. Central Park. Central Park. Times Square. Times Square. Times Square. 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 Center. Rockefeller Center. Rockefeller Center. Statue of Liberty. Okay, close my okay, cl uh, close microphones. Close microphones. Again, the Empire State Building. Grand Central Terminal. Central Park, Times Square, Rockefeller Center, the Statue of Liberty. Okay, so these are some of the uh, most famous tourist attractions on the map. I let me see something run over there. Ah, oh. <laughs> the questions. <laughs> Okay. Uh, uh, you, where are the where are the uh, what do you know about these places now? What do you know about these places now? Uh huh. That they uh, are. Uh, uh, in what country? In what city? Well, uh, I. I know the attraction are in New York City. Okay, they are in New York City. Uh -huh. The Statue sta 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 of Liberty mm -hmm. is a symbol. From freedom. Ah, okay, yes, yeah, simple for freedom. Thank you very much, Don. Uh, it's a Don Julio Don Vicente. I was calling you another name last class, I guess. Uh, yeah, Don Julio, I was calling you Vicente. <laughs> Sorry, thank you very much, Don Julio. Someone else, what else do you know about this, uh, these places? Uh huh. Don Julio said that uh, the uh, the Statue of Liberty is a uh, is, is a symbol of freedom. It's in New York City. Uh, and what about the other places? In your own words, anything, cualquier cosa que me digan, it's okay. Uh huh. Okay, so let me show you the other question. Okay, what makes them popular? Because they are uh, top 10 tourist attractions. So, oh. And uh, so what tourist attractions do we have in the country, in El Salvador? What tourist 
<laughs> ah, the Tunco Beach. Okay. El Salvador has wonderful beaches. What else? Uh huh. Cotepeca Lake. Huh? The Cotepeca Lake. Ah, Cotepeca Lake is a very nice tourist attraction also, not in just international, but also national. Okay, and what else? What about here in, in San Salvador? What is very popular? Salvador del Mundo. Ah, Salvador del Mundo is very popular around the world. Jacqueline, you were going to say something. Uh, galeria. Uh, galerias? I'm sorry. Uh, uh, Centro San Salvador. Ah, the historic center of uh, San Salvador. Why is the historic center, uh, Centro yes. Historico, very famous? What tourist attractions uh, are there? Uh, uh, el Teatro. Ah, the National Theater. Yeah, National Theater is very famous and it's a, a very nice architectonic uh, design or building. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. What else? Okay, there are other places over there. Let me tell you that uh, National, uh, the historic center of San Salvador is no le quita nada, nada a... Uh, uh, I am Mexico, where está el teatro, ¿cómo se llama? The National Palace, or the uh, Peter Palace, I forgot the name, El Zócalo, okay? Because of the Architectonic Center. Okay, so here we have many, many, El Salvador has uh, beautiful beaches, beautiful, uh, it has nice volcanoes, lakes, um, Oh, there and here in San Salvador, we have the historic center and so on. Okay, there we have a conversation. What do you see on the picture? What? A, eh, me parece que le está explicando sobre el edificio. Okay, so what would you say in English, Julio? <laughs> Uh, do you think that this guy yes, lives please. there or is a tourist? Is he a tourist or he lives there in New York? Uh huh. The, the explain the building. Ah, okay. She's telling about the building, explaining about the building. Okay, let's see what the conversation is that about. Uh, what building is the, are they looking at? What which what is the name of this building? What is the name of this building? What buildings do we have in this picture? What buildings do we have in the picture? Look over there. We had the Empire State Building, Grand Central Terminal, Central Park, Rockefeller Center, Times Square, and the Statue of Liberty. So what building are they looking at? The cathedral. Uh, okay, maybe it's a cathedral. Another auction. The Empire State Building. Um, maybe the Empire State Building. Good. And where are they? In what city are they? Are the people? New York City. And they are in New York City. Okay. Uh, thank you very much for answering the question. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. But when you answer the question, try to say they are in New York City. They are looking at the Empire State Building. Let me tell you why. Déjenme decirles por qué. Cuando aprendemos inglés, cuando estamos aprendiendo, es importante que tratemos de expresar oraciones completas para que nuestra mente vaya agarrando el idioma como tal, okay? So, por eso, okay? Good. Yeah, they are in, uh, they are looking at the Spire State Building and they are in New York City. Good. So, let's see the question over there. Okay, let's listen and read. Page 89, exercise 8, conversation. Is it far from here? Listen and practice. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? How do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? 
Just walk up Fifth Avenue to 50th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Okay, one more time. Page 89, Exercise 8, Conversation. Is it far from here? Listen for details, okay? Listen and practice. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? How do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Just walk up Fifth Avenue to 50th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Okay, what place is the man looking for? What place is the man looking for? He's looking for St. Patrick's Cathedral. He's looking for St. Patrick's Cathedral. Good, excellent. Okay, and where is uh, another volunteer? Where is St. Patrick's Cathedral? Where is it? Uh -huh. I need to fight. Uh, I forgot 50. Ah, no. <laughs> fix it, fix it. 50. Uh -huh. Fix Avenue to 50 Street. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, uh, fix Avenue uh, and Fix Street. Okay. And where exactly? On the right or on the left? On the left. Or on the right? On the right. On the right. So everybody, uh, let me see if I see my picture. Okay. Uh, so I'm here. So you are, creo que así están ustedes. Okay. So this is my right. This is my left. Okay. Let me see. Uh, right, left. Right, left. Creo que así están ustedes en esa posición. So, but in, in like this way, so this is my right, this is my right, this is my left. On, on the left, we say on the right. So, for example, if we um, we uh, look at uh, a place, let's, so we say it's right on the left, it's right on the right. Okay, and what other places, uh, oh, what place is near St. Uh, Patrick Cathedral? What other building is uh, uh, near uh, St. Patrick Cathedral? It is near, it is near Rockefeller Center uh, and it's... I'm very stable. Okay, it's near Rockefeller Center, okay. And what other place is the man looking for? And what other place is the man looking for? It is in Fire State Building. Okay, it's Fire State Building. Thank you, Don Julio. Another volunteer. Where is it? Where is it? It's right behind you. It's right behind you. So behind me is my kitchen, <laughs> not, the, not the Empire State Building. So it's right behind you. Look around and then you say like this, look around and you go like this, okay? So that's, those are, those are, those are and uh, let's see, uh, uh, Nubia, help me with the learning objective. Que estábamos viendo ahí? Practice. Uh huh. Nubia, are you there? I sorry. It's practical oh. conversation between a tourist and and a woman. And a woman. See, direct, see direction in context. See directions and context. Now, what will be the directions? 
tell me which ones are the directions in context. Read the conversation. Now quiero que ustedes la descubran. Uh -huh. For example, walk up Fifth Avenue to Fifty Street. That's one. Yes. Okay. Walk. Uh, walk up, or we can say walk down. Oops. Ya me perdí el lápiz. Okay. So that that's good. Excellent. So walk up. Uh huh. Uh, Fifth Avenue. Another. Uh huh. Another. It's right across from. It's it's right. What is it? It's right across from. Okay. It's right across from. Uh huh. Uh, and we're missing one behind. Después they walk up. What is the one that we're missing? On the right. On the right. It's on the right. Okay. We always use on the right, on the left. On the right, I mean, on the left. This is my left, on the right, okay? And uh, another? Another? It's right behind. It's right behind you. So those are given directions, okay? So you've been and just, uh, it's right behind you. Just torn, torn. Turn. What is it? Turn around. Turn around and look up. Okay. So those are the things that we were studying. Uh, we were um, is, is studying over here. Let me just, uh, let's see. Okay. Oh. Okay. There is an, uh, there is an instruction over there. Uh, this is for the teacher. So it says, what it says over there? Uh, point out that, uh huh. Quien me ayuda a leer eso recuadro? Who helped point, me read? Uh huh. Point out that in on the right, on the right, right. Uh, uh -huh. direction means the uh, directions. Uh -huh. in, across from and in, right behind you. Uh -huh. Right means exactly or um, I don't know what. Or directly, directly. Uh -huh. Repeat, directly. Everybody repeat, directly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Everybody repeat, exactly, directly. Okay. Yeah. Uh, on the right means uh, a direction. So I'm giving you, it's on the right. It's on the left. It's on the right. Okay. Right across from or right behind you means exactly. Okay. So that's why when you tell like this, you say in exactly places. Okay. So let's uh, see what is the grammar on. We just have a couple of minutes. Let me quitar esas líneas. Quito aquí. Okay. So, given directions, what is the learning objective? What is the learning objective? Practice asking for and giving directions. And giving directions. Practice asking for and give directions or giving directions. Okay, let's listen and read. Page 90, exercise nine, grammar focus. Directions. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Walk up Fifth Avenue. Go up Fifth Avenue. Turn left on 49th Street. It's on the right. How can I get to Bryant Park? Walk down 5th Avenue. Go down 5th Avenue. Turn right on 42nd Street. It's on the left. Now let's listen and repeat. No microphones, okay? Page 90, 
Exercise 9. Grammar Focus. Directions. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Walk up Fifth Avenue. Go up Fifth Avenue. Turn left on 49th Street. It's on the right. Turn left on 49th Street. It's on the right. The next column. How can I get to Bryant Park? How can I get to Bryant Park? Walk down Fifth Avenue. Walk down Fifth Avenue. Go down Fifth Avenue. Go down Fifth Avenue. Turn right on 42nd Street. Turn right on 42nd Street. It's on the left. It's on the left. Okay, so how do I get and how can I get? They have the same meaning. Okay, so you say, um, how do I get to the uh, to the supermarket? Oh, uh, go up on second forty uh, second Avenue. It's on the left. Okay, this. They have the same meaning. You can say, how can I get to the bank or uh, to the supermarket? Or you can say, how can I get to the supermarket? So either using do, you can use do to ask the question, the auxiliary, uh, the auxiliary verb. How do I get? Or you can say, how can I get using can? As auxiliary. They have the same meaning. La respuesta va a ser the same one. Now, and what is the other sentence? How do they get to the Rockefeller Center? And the other is, and the other is, for example, walk up, go, go, go up, okay? They have the same meaning. So go up or walk walk up. They have the same meaning. Okay. Uh, camina o ve derecho. Okay. Camina derecho o ve derecho. Like like we would say. And the other go walk down and go down is the same. Okay. And then you can say turn left or turn right, or you can say it's on the left, it's on the right, you see? Okay, uh, picture these images, this, and let's go moving. Let's do a couple of exercises on, on the map, looking at the map. Let's look at the map over here. Okay. Uh, let's see, this one, it's easier. So, for example, we are, we are here. Ven lo que es la línea que estoy poniendo, las crucecitas? Yes? Yes. Okay. Uh, so we are here. So how can I get to the bank? How do I get to the bank? Uh, uh -huh. I go up. You can say, you can mention the street. You can mention the street. Go up. Go on up the... on, 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 Main go up, street. Uh -huh, go up on Main Street, and then. Mm, uh, cross, cross in the corner. 
Ah, it's a cross or is it another word that we use? Turn left. Turn left. Good. Turn left. Turn left. Uh -huh. And now? And um, it's, on the right. it's on the right. It's on the right. Yes. Okay. Another another exercise. Um, how do I get to, let me see, I don't see it. Uh, how do I get to uh, the park? Ahí va el carrito de nuevo. Ajá. What is the direction? Right on. Okay, walk on or walk down, whatever. And then? Turn left. Okay, turn. Uh, okay, left or right? Is it left or right? I don't know. And then, okay, soon, and then? Mainstream. Uh-huh, it's on? It's right. on the left. It's on the, on the left, right? Right. Okay, good. Okay, I, one more, one more, uh, uh, one more, but let's use the other map. Please uh, participate as much as you can. Por eso estoy haciendo esto, eh? Let me erase the, the okay. Erase the things over there. Okay. Okay, we are, uh, let me see, where are we? Okay, we are here. Uh, uh, casi no se ve. Pero ven donde estoy haciendo el machoncito, right? Yes? Yes. Okay, how yes. did I get to the bookstore? Mm. Uh huh. Turn right. Turn right mm. on. On. Main Street. On Main Street. Um. Uh huh. Turn right on Main Street. Uh -huh. go, go, up. go up. Go up. Go up. On Second Avenue. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Turn right. Uh, Center Street. Okay. Uh, well, yeah, maybe it's possible to turn right on, on Center Street. But I'm here, I, and so the, the shoe store is over here. So it's on the left. On the, right. uh, <laughs> it's on the right. It's on the right. Another option that you can say is uh, walk down, for example, walk down to Main Street. Listen, walk down to Main Street. Turn left there. Uh, turn right on Main Street and walk down until second street then turn left and go down and and walk up or go down and then you will say it's on the it's on the it's on the in front of, in front of it's on the right. Ah, okay, se me pasó el tiempo, pues estaba emocionado. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, go ahead. Sorry, estaba emocionado. Ay, 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 ay. Ah, uh, let me see. Abel, Abel Herminio está aquí o en la otra? Presentation. Okay, uh, Ana Gabriela. Claudia Elizabeth, solo voy a llamar una vez. Present. Okay, Elsa Cecilia. Present. Emily de Los Angeles. Present. Glenda Elizabeth. Jacqueline Lorena. Julio, Present. Ant Julio Antonio Orantes. Present teacher. Karen Vanessa Aguilar Romero. Carla Susena de los ah, Carla Susana Ángel López. Catherine Andrea Sánchez. Crisia Elizabeth Portillo. 
present. Luis Edenilson Díaz Valles. Present. Marilyn Ruby Mulato. Present. Marvin Ruby Mulato. Present. Minor Alexander As Avelar. Miriam Janet Villato Villalobos Segovia. Present. Nubia Beatriz Rivas Alvarenga. Present. Robert Adalberto García González. Present. Silvia Andrea Córdoba Sarabia. Present. Tatiana uh, Michelle Pineda. Present. Enseña, enseña. Uh, es, Present. Esmeralda. Ok, bye bye, guys. See you. Goodbye. Bye. Practice.